understand what is an approach approach means a way of dealing with a situation or a problem now in curriculum organization we include many approaches we will see some of the major approaches in the curriculum organization first is topical approach based on the importance the topics are selected and placed in a systematic order topics which are relevant to day to day life and today's world are included in the subjects of higher classes now this approach makes the teaching learning process very interesting and suits to their psychological needs this is topical approach and next we have logical approach it is also called as funnel concept or funnel approach this is based on hierarchy or level of difficulty that means the topics are arranged in a simple to complex manner and contents are arranged in a logical order next we have subject centered curriculum in subject centered curriculum particular subject matter or discipline is concentrated for example a subject centered curriculum may focus on math or biology this type of curriculum design tends to focus on the subject rather than the individual next we have activity approach learning by doing is the principle followed by this approach in this instructions based on problem solving and use of experiments are used in this approach next we have concentric approach in concentric approach these circles have a common center but radius goes on changing concept in this concentric approach knowledge is widened slowly and steadily like concentric circles we have seen this is subject matter is taken and spread over number of years in introductory years elementary knowledge is given then in next year little higher level knowledge is added and this is done in all subsequent years thus a study program is maintained to impart knowledge to students this concentric approach involves the addition of knowledge from basic to advanced level and it is a continuous process and this approach becomes successful if one teacher handles the subject continuously in different years next we have integrated approach in this importance is given to all the subjects teaching is carried out in an integrated manner and it tries to inspire the pupils to have a coherent view and next conceptual approach so in curriculum design curriculum is based on facts and concepts which are arranged in a hierarchical manner next we have unitary approach in this approach entire curriculum is divided into units subunits lessons or topics for example if we take the world of living unit 2 world of living life process it includes sub topics like living being basic concepts of nutrition respiration transport and excretion in plants and animals so this approach is followed by a textbook next we have environmental approach any individual is a part of the physical social and cultural environment therefore he or she will have more affinity towards the curriculum which is framed according to the environment and this approach planner will surely emphasize on aspects of environment such as natural environment social environment and cultural environment like 
forests, mountains, atmosphere, public places like market places, theaters, cultural environment, festivals, exhibitions, industries, agriculture, etc. So these are the approaches, major approaches in curriculum organization. I think you have clearly learned about these approaches. Thank you so much for listening.